Turn it up, mm. turn it up, turn it up, turn it up. Hello, welcome in. Hi. What's your name? Raja. Raja, how yes. old are you? I'm 24 years old. And what do you do? I'm a law student. Okay, nice. Uh, what are some things I could do for fun? I love to travel. I like to journal. I like to walk my dog. And I like to just be really adventurous um, and have fun with my partner. Okay, mm -hmm. nice. Um, speaking of partners, what are some things you look for in a man? Oh, they have to be honest, okay. confident, um, really secure in themselves. Mm -hmm. Um, able to compromise, okay. and we have shared values and beliefs. Got it, got it. Yes. And now, what are some of your deal breakers? If you don't like dogs, like, <laughs> my dog is my everything. So if you don't like dogs, let me know that now. Okay. <laughs> uh, what else? Someone who's a narcissist mm. um, and somebody who's not a decision maker. They have other people make their decisions, such as their family, friends, somebody on the street. Like, I just need you to be a man got it yeah okay cool cool all right so we don't have any balloons popped so i'm actually going to switch it on over to you and i'm going to hand you a pick so <laughs> there you go and i am going to have you pop hmm let's go with two balloons okay based off of what you're seeing you know who may not really be your type whatever it is go ahead and pop those two balloons okay okay Dang, okay, he getting popped every time. All right, let's start right on over here. Okay. Name and he age. Getting popped every John, time. John, I'm 31. Okay, and now John, you did have your balloon unpopped. Why so? She's beautiful. I'm not shallow, so I wanted to hear what she was talking about. You feel me? But I mean, she's a nice little young young woman, so I approach her. Okay, got it. <laughs> and now, why you end up popping his balloon? Um, you see, your name is John. Yeah. Well, John, you look really nice. Um, just there wasn't like an initial attraction i would say mm -hmm. but you seem sweet she has so. like a lisp going on. Yeah. <laughs> all right and then we did pop one more let's head on over here your name and age how you doing my name is nazi i'm 25 years old okay and nazi why did you have your balloon unpopped she's very pretty i like the dress you know orange is a nice color on you thank you uh, i want just wanted to hear you i get to know you better okay got it got it now why do we end up popping his well i would say the same thing like you do look nice um really friendly just there wasn't like initial attraction again okay. but you seem fine <laughs> yeah all right cool all right. Thank really you. respectable <laughs> okay next round i'm gonna go ahead and have you ask these guys a question just to help you narrow it down okay so guys how should the roles and responsibilities be shared in a household okay let's start with your name and age and how should the roles be shared uh, my name is Dante. I'm 25. Uh, the roles in the household, I grew up in a traditional household, so dad works and stuff like that, grinds out, makes sure the home is taken care of, the kids are taken care of and stuff like that. Mom does what she's great at, which is nurturing and stuff like that, you feel me? Taking mm -hmm. care of making sure when I come home, everybody's taking care of my kids and stuff like that, making sure she's good. I got to make sure, hey, if something's not right, yo, let me go take care of that and stuff like that and bring it back home. But I'm very traditional, very, extremely, actually. Okay. Yeah. Name and age and the answer to her question. My name's Ryan, I'm 26, mm -hmm. and I'll echo that. I'm very traditional as well, so as the man, I would be taking the stereotypical man role where being the breadwinner, and if there's something wrong with the lawnmower, that's on me, um, it's not on you. Uh, I'm carrying in all the groceries, like stuff like that. And then again, assuming we had a family, I would want my wife to be the one leading the uh, nurturing of the children and uh, educating them and stuff like that and hopefully she can cook as well that would be a great bonus because i cannot cook for shit <laughs> <laughs> all right You're being honest even age and the answer to her question chris 27 and i'll say i grew up in a single mom household so i'm still learning as i go within my all the relationships i've been through so yeah i usually do take on a more traditional role like take care of you know if she's staying with me take care of the bills taking care of the, the manly stuff, like you said, like all the, like the changing the tire, taking out the trash, all of that. But as far as like monetarily, like I grew up seeing my mom do it all, you know? So I need another woman that can, she doesn't have to do it all, but she had to be able to do something, you know? Mm -hmm. I do like a little Miss Independent a little bit. Okay. All right, name and age and answer to your question. I'm Trey, 25. Uh, I've seen both done. Uh, effectively in terms of 
both partners working and then one partner uh, I had a stay at home mom later in my life. So I really believe in what does the home need? Like uh -huh. that's between the two people to understand. Like you, for example, you're in law school. That's mm -hmm. a very high paying job. It'd be, it'd be crazy of me to ask you to, to sacrifice that entirely and not chase after this dream. Cause law school is a lot. That's high school, college and some old school, some old school. <laughs> and so I believe in understanding like, hey, tonight might not be a, a U night to wash dishes. Tonight might not be a, a, a U night to, to, to set up everything for the kids. Cause mm -hmm. I, I, I'll be honest, I can change a tire. I have AAA and it works though. <laughs> and so I would much rather not. Now, if it's hot and we in Phoenix, like, I, if need be, but my AAA works. Uh, but yeah, I believe, in, I believe in modernity and I believe in like progressing those roles. They don't have to be static like they were in the past. Okay, okay that's good. And then we did get a pop. Let's mm -hmm. head down well, over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Yeah, I'm Key, 28. Uh, I pop just cause uh, you know, she's a law student. Uh, that's a lot of time, you know, I'm, I'm a business owner. Mm -hmm. And so you've been a law student, like my time is limited. Your time is gonna be limited. That's a lot of school and everything, trying to build a family and whatnot. Uh, and then also, I mean, you're a pretty woman, mm -hmm. but just not really, uh, just not too attracted. But mm -hmm. I mean, you don't look bad at all. <laughs> now, is he someone that's your type? Um, you look decent, but I mean, like you're decent, like. Okay. It looked like you tried. Um. <laughs> hey, that's what's up. All right. <laughs> yeah, you're decent. Okay. Cool. 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 It's all good. Thank mm -hmm. you. All right. <laughs> okay, and we did get a pop back here. Why did we end up popping? So, if we look in long term, you know, building a family, I'm a little taller. You know, nothing gets the short queens. I love the short queens, but she, you just look like you're like five foot, maybe. So like it's a little, you know. So I like I'm like a little taller, a five six, five eight. Got it, got it. <laughs> yeah, five, now six, is he five, someone eight. that's your type? Um, you look fine, but like for a partner, I'm looking for someone more like. I don't know, more dapper. Dapper. Mm -hmm. Okay. Got it. Yeah. I'd be putting it on, I ain't gonna lie. Like, I wear suits, so I just, you know? It's cool. Okay, got sure. it. You said I wear Thank suits. You. Uh. All right, so we do have two left, guys. Oh, I'm sorry, uh, three. You keep hiding that balloon. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we have three mm -hmm. left. Uh, go ahead and ask these guys another question. Okay. What are some qualities that you look for in a partner? Okay. What are some qualities you look for? Uh, number one's major is respect. Um, I don't care really about the love and everything. Respect comes with honesty, communication, everything else and stuff like that. If you're going to respect me, you're gonna do what's right at the end of the day. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So at first and then it's just like a rapper say, I don't want luck, loyalty, da da. I want respect. You feel me? Mm -hmm. I grew up on that. Respect my father. Respect my coaches. Respect the pastors and shit. Respect the homeless people when I go to give stuff out for community service and shit like that. You mm -hmm. feel me? It's just a different thing. Growing up, like I used to be, look big and shit like that. People didn't respect me. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Like they overlooked me and shit like. So it's something deeper. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. Um, stole my answer. Respect first, but I'll, I'll add to that. I also think someone who's peaceful. I'm looking just for someone who can be my peace because I go through stressful situations and I've got my own stuff going on. So having a woman do what she does best, which is be like that peaceful feminine energy, mm -hmm. that's what I care most about. Okay. All right. Let's head on over here. Name and age. No, just answer the question. Should have got your name. And make it make it show. Uh, I believe versatility, ambition, and empathy are are really important for a partner because I don't. I was talking about modernity earlier. I don't believe in one thing. I don't believe in like a, a single track mind. I don't believe in somebody not wanting to venture out and be broad and trying. And you said you were adventurous, so that's already yeah. that's already a check. But mm -hmm. along with that, I need somebody that loves God. And not just like, oh, God is cool, woody, 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 but what's your sign? No, I need somebody that, that loves God, for real, for real. And so if you don't have that, you just go ahead. Yeah. But all three, all four of those things. Yeah, I'm a believer. So. Amen. Come on yes. now. Eba. <laughs> all right. <laughs> okay, it is time to e pop a oh, balloon. I can ask another question. No, oh. let's go ahead and pop. <laughs> she going to pop him at the end. Why is she lying, bro? Okay, never mind. All right. Okay, what do you end up popping him? You have muscles. <laughs> you have muscles. Yeah, it looks like you work out. <laughs> she said you have muscles. I appreciate um, you. 
Do you typically like wear this attire or? Uh, genuinely so. I'm from Michigan. I'm a country boy. You know awesome. what I'm saying? So. Roy's, I want to go back to the country and shit, but I dab her down like everybody else and shit, but I don't care about society's norms. I look good. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to wear what I'm going to wear. Yeah. You feel me? Okay, that was really, I just had a pop some on the other oh, side. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I like your answer, though. <laughs> Is she someone that's your type? Uh, yes, for sure, 100%. You feel me? Like, I, on offense a little bit, I wanted to hear her out, what she's really going to say and stuff like that, and, you know, see how good she's going to articulate uh, her answers and stuff like that. You see the death in it and stuff like that, but she's did well did very well okay cool thank you all right so our two remaining guys any questions for our good lady yes um what is oh your... she's asking okay oh go ahead oh it's okay you can ask <laughs> <laughs> you were ready oh. go for it go for it <laughs> well i was going to ask for you guys occupations okay okay occupations, occupations. Mm -hmm. um got the... i own two different media companies so Making YouTube videos and stuff like that is really the main gig. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then while we're here, any questions for her? I was going to ask, what do you think your life's purpose is? My life's purpose. Well, I would say because I'm in law school, I went to law school because I want to help disadvantaged communities and just get them out of the situations that they're in. For instance, instance I do want to go into criminal law and be a prosecutor or a defender, um, especially within my community in the Cleveland neighborhood. So I just really want to give back. Are you, is that where you live, Cleveland? Or Yes, I'm from Cleveland. Okay. Yeah, so we're I have that Indian's oh. hat, <laughs> but I'm still gonna pipe. Um, I, I gotta pop it, sorry. Um, Cause it's too far for me. Okay. Yeah. Where are you from? I live in LA. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. okay. All right. Thank you. Let's head on over here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And then what was, he what, the what do you do? Yes. And then if you have any questions for her. Got you. Uh, I'm a development project manager at a tech company uh, right now. And then question I have for you, I was gonna ask something similar to purpose, mm -hmm. but what is something that your friends would say two years ago you struggled with, but you've made significant growth in today? Wow. I would question. say, <laughs> that they would say that I struggle with like moving on from situations that no longer serve me. So I feel like I really developed from that today. Um, just being able to put the past behind me, look towards the future, okay. know that there's better things happening, better things to come for me. And I feel like they would really respect that. Like she's able to boss up, move on and be a better person. Let's see, is he biting on that? Mm -hmm. Huh. All right, let me have you. Come on. Okay, up, okay. He's up. biting on it. He's biting on it. Let's walk Come on. Let's see. Oh, what? whoa. Right, Why he walking like that? So, she might pop him. Between the two of you before we determine if this is a match. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. just and keep it a bill. Mm -hmm. Am I fine to you? <laughs> like, okay. like, fine. Like I like I'm going I'm walking into your church and and your 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 deaconesses looking at. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Man, you gonna get popped. I man. think you are attractive. Oh, for sure. she gonna pop them. Um, she gonna pop I like your outfit. I like the way that you carried yourself. Thank you. Um, oh, I like that you listened to over. my answers. It's over. Um, you're a great listener. Um, but you said like fine, like I spot yeah. you out, and I'm like, ooh, I want him. Yeah. Not necessarily, but you know, my types do change when I look at the person's personality and how they present themselves, but. But you say you still find him attractive. Yes, he's attractive. Yeah. Why you look at me like that? Cause you looking for a reason to pop. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, I'm, I'm a sucker for a middle part now. I ain't gonna lie to you. I, I, I tell you what. Okay. But all right, let's go. You good. All right. So then, okay, with that okay, being said, okay, is it gonna okay. be a yes for you for her? Yes, Lord. <laughs> and is it a yes for you for him? You said. Oh no, I was. Is it a yes for you for him? She gonna pop. <laughs> oh my goodness, bro. Okay. Why okay. she? Oh my. Look at it. I told you she was gonna pop. I thought she, I thought I was wrong for a second though. I thought I was wrong for a second. But <laughs> look at his face. <laughs> I paused at the right time. He, his heart is hurting. Ross said they didn't ask some good questions. They are asking some good questions. Man, yeah, but the, yeah, the walk was crazy. The walk. 
<clears throat> I don't know why he, did. he 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 was trying to be funny. I think he was trying to be funny about it. But man, I I I felt it. I felt she was gonna pop. I didn't know why she didn't pop it. That's what happened. What he ended well, up popping. I just feel like maybe for me it wasn't like an immediate yes. And I feel like when you're in a relationship, you need that like immediate like yeah, like I want him, like let's go. But oh, that's why I asked. That what was I asked. It. Yeah, yeah, I just. The environment. Like, maybe it could progress to that, but not. Just I agree. Initially. I mean, the environment. This environment is made for like stuff yeah, like that. Exactly. I just want you to be sure that this is something that like you're not mm -hmm. gonna go home two weeks later and go back home and be like, he not really even that cute. Like yeah. I don't. That's not for Trey. Yeah. Yeah. You're not. Yeah. You don't waste Thank no time. You. you can head back over there. Don't waste there. no time. All right. Well, that is all the popped balloons. But we do thank oh, you for just coming on. I'll take this mic. Never and mind. let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. Might need to go see the chiropractor or something.